it's repetition, it's practice, and it's, it's you know, becoming more confident in what you're doing. And I say it's a lot easier because we're genuinely friends. Like, I was telling my mother the other day, I was like, it's, I'm very thankful to be in a band that, like, I'm genuinely in, like, a group where I care, like, deeply about every person in the band. And it's not, like, one person in the band is kind of like, the no, like, we're really, like, brothers. Like, it's really a crazy, and it, and it makes it easy. So it's like, even when, you know, some bands who may not be familiar to each other, somebody might mess up, and they look at them like, we mess up, we look at each other like, like, you know, just like, bro, like. You know, so it's, like, it, it's, it's way cooler yeah. growing, growing with people. That yeah, you know. yeah, because you know, like you care, you want we, you know, we, you have that type of connection. You know, you want everybody to be happy with what we're doing. So, you know, it's a, you know, it's a passion that we we all share. You know, as far as how we grew up, music grew up on. So, we just have like we're very lucky to be able to find and have the band that we have. Man, you know, I'm always fortunate for that because you know we definitely could be the other. It could be the other way around. Our sound, I think, it's always evolving, like every day, and. For the next project, we'll probably have a little bit more like, like live stuff, like live horns and live strings and stuff. As, as in general, I've gotten way better as a singer um, in a little while, and we, we're all just becoming better musicians. So. I'll say, I'll say, with the next album, um, we definitely, from the songs that we haven't released, it's a lot cleaner, and not cleaner in a way of like making it where it's not weird anymore. Like you lose the like the little weirdness that made it cool. No, like. Which you know, it's more tight. It's, you, the groove is more defined because you know a lot of them on our older music. You know, the groove will go here and then it'll go like toe to the other right. I think, you know, we still have those types of things, but we've learned to find I think find that medium and like find something that like everybody can listen to and something that people who are like in the weird music can appreciate at the same time. So yeah, we're figuring it out. Yeah, we got in the studio with Tyler like two weeks ago. Started on a, on a track. Uh, he's probably gonna produce a track and he's probably gonna be featured on one of the songs. So. Yeah. Very, looking forward to, to working yeah. with them. And, and, you know, the reason we didn't have them on the first couple albums is because we wanted to, to prove to ourselves and to everybody else that we can do this by ourselves yeah. without a cosign. Of, yeah, event, without you know? the big feature that everybody wants to go to right yeah, when the album's you know, released. We wanted them to be about our music, you know, so it worked out. And so now we're working with them on the next stuff, you know, now that we've established ourselves. Yeah. And, we, and we, 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 all, we work with Tebe all the time. Like, you know, yeah, we, yeah. when he first got back from Hawaii, he was staying at our house, so. We have like many beats that haven't been released that we just, you know, we just got sitting around. So, you know, it's yeah. it's always like those are like another you know, it's like family. Like you don't always see them, but like when we see like it's something that we all share, like a connection that we all share that we, you know, if we need them on the album they're going to come, but you know, like they understand like we wanted to do it on our own at first. And you you know, they definitely respect it. You can tell by how, you know, how they, how they treat us now. <laughs> yeah. Well, Rebelum uh, uh, that's one of my favorite. Oh, every song on there is like a little story, but that one it was produced by Thundercat, who um, our keyboard player is actually uh, Thundercat. They're brothers, and um, so just went over his house one day and he played it for me. I was like, "Can I have that?" And he gave, and and and, um, and he gave it. No, yeah, he gave it to us, and the song just kind of came to me one day. It was really awesome, that, you know. Good thing is the next album he's gonna be a lot uh, like involved a lot more so yeah. you know no no like, we're just we're like it's past music like we're like family like you know literally like his brothers in our group so you know like it's you know that's that's family now you know it's crazy because like a year ago a year and a half ago we were like man I wish Thundercat would just like like let us know that he know we exist like <laughs> so it's like it's cool that like he's like you know like an older brother that's like a real mentor a real level headed guy that you know he still has a great spark of youth. But at the same time, you know, he's very good if you need, you know, good advice on life, period, you know, yeah. so. Nah, I don't want to give all we that don't, We don't know yet, so. We, we, got, so we got some people we're working with, but we're working with some new people that's really fine. And I ain't going to say name, but yeah, next album is going to be real tight. Like, we're going for, like, some real, like, trying to get the females on the floor to dance. That's, we, you know, that's, that's really all we want. We want, the, we want the girls to dance, man, like, we want them on the floor. Nah. Yeah. We gonna release Next some. Year, we'll be releasing some like straight tracks throughout the year. Like, um, you know, my friend Cash has a mixtape coming out. She, you know, we might have a song on there. So, we'll be releasing like songs that make sense with friends and stuff like that. But, you know, we really want to focus this year on touring.